Drivers. Drivers. Truckers. People of all ages. Come on out to the Minneapolis Fairgrounds and TA Truck Stop for the Blizzard Lizard Lot Lizard Blowout. That's right, drivers. We'll have lot lizards from all over the country. Horizontal hostesses. Sleeper creepers. And all kinds of other women out there doing their thing and hocking their wares. That's right. If you've wanted it, you've been looking for it, you'll find it this Saturday night at the TA Truck Stops and Fairgrounds in Minneapolis, Minnesota. Be there. I've got a shower ticket here truck driver 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 I got a shower ticket I've got a shower ticket I got a shower ticket looking for two dollars I got a shower ticket for looking two two dollars I got a shower ticket looking for two dollars I got two dollars I got two dollars for three I got two dollars for three I got two dollars for the shower ticket two dollars for the shower ticket for, I've got three dollars I got three dollars from the JB Hunt driver three dollars for the shower ticket and he needs it pretty bad three dollars for the shower ticket three dollars I've got three dollars looking for four three dollars looking for four four dollars going once Four dollars going twice. Four dollars going to the Schneider driver. Needs it the work. I used to be a bank president, an executive type with a big car and a big office. But now I've left that stressful life to get a more lucrative career of lumping trucks. Because now I can unload trucks for a living. By unloading trucks for cash money, I can put money in my pocket, feed my family, and still collect a welfare check. After all, that's how it works. You get cash money from truck drivers to unload their truck. And the next thing you know, you got the welfare check and the social security check coming in. And you got cash money to spend on yourself. Here, you can buy an old truck with a CB radio and go hang out at truck stops all day with some real nice people. So come on, join the International Lumpers Union. And I'll give you a free brochure on how to do it. Just call me at 1-900-LUMP-IT. That's 1-900-LUMP-IT. 50 cents for the call. It goes in my pocket. Golly, I left the Marine Corps and now I've got a great job. I'm a truck stop mechanic. I can make 65 to $80 an hour working on big trucks. When I left the Marine Corps, Sergeant Carter told me I would never amount to anything but a lump of coal. Well, I left lumping and now I'm a mechanic. Now I can damn near fix anything. Gee, thanks, Sergeant Carter, for those words of encouragement. Hi, this is Ronald Reagan. Ever since I left the presidency, I've had not much to do with my spare time. So I started my own trucking company with my wife, Nancy, and my dog, Fido. Oh, sir. No, sir. It's Tippy. Uh, excuse me, Tippy. Well, Nancy says I have a great future in truck driving. There's only one problem. I can't remember where I parked the truck. in 16 years. My God, your mother told you not to become a truck driver. But look at you now. Fat, 
bald, drunk. You look just like me, son. I'm so damn proud of you. And now, answers to the CDL questions brought to you by Little Brother Trucker. That's right, drivers. Hey, when we come back to the CDL questions, we're going to ask you things like, when backing up to your trailer, what's the proper way to back up to it and pass the CDL test? Is it A, back underneath the trailer completely and hook it up? B, roll the landing gear up back up to the trailer and back under it. C, back up to the trailer, hook it up and then back under it. Or D, wake up Leroy. Question number two regards the lights and illumination on your truck. You may have A, 3,000 lights maximum on your rig, but only two of them have to work. B, two lights on your rig and only one of them has to work. Or C, any number of lights you want, but they all have to work. Or D, Leroy holding a flashlight, and it has to work. Drivers, when checking your tires for proper inflation, should you A, check your tires with a tire thumper, B, kick the shit out of your tires with the back of your boot, C, look and see if any of them are flat on top, or D, hand the tire gauge to Leroy. Question number four regards the distance allowed between the top of the fifth wheel and the bottom of the trailer during a hookup. How much play should there be? A. Just a smidgen. B. A cunt hair. C. None. Or D. The length of Leroy's Peter. This has been a pubic service announcement brought to you by Truck Stop Comedy. Drivers, do you want to piss those people off from Truck Stop that won't talk to you? Yes, do they keep making you mad every time you drive through the parking lot and make fun of your yellow doors? Well, now you can piss them off in style. That's right, with the new Music Man systems for your CB. That's right, with Music Man systems, you'll be able to play music right there on the radio. Yes, you can play it for hours on end and really kill them when they can't get out. So try one today. That's the new music systems for your CB radio. Music system sold in all TA truck stops.
Neighbors, would you like to make extra money while you're driving down the road? Yes, try the new Toro Bush Hog to mount on the front of your tractor. That's right, with the Toro Bush Hog, you can drive down the road and trim the trees as you're seeing the countryside. That's right, you can do the job the state was always supposed to do but never had time to do it because her budget was too short. Yes, with the new Toro Bush Hog, you can get rid of all those unwanted limbs and trees around power lines. Hey, don't forget with the new Toro Bush Hog, if one of those little four-wheelers pisses you off, just move over to the hammer lane. That's right, lower the bush hog down on him and rip his top off. Yes, you'll have a ball driving trucks now that you have the new Toro Bush Hog. Toro Bush Hogs, available in all truck stops.